Hello and welcome to Sony Ericsson Support. In this video, you'll learn how to use Timescape. Press the Home key and locate Timescape. Tap Timescape. Drag up and down across the screen to preview events. The newest events are on top. You can see what kind of tile you're viewing by looking at the Tile Content icon in the right-hand corner. Tap a tile to view an event. Tapping a Facebook tile will take you to the Facebook website. Tapping a Twitter tile will take you to the Twitter website. By tapping an SMS and MMS message, you can reply to the message. And finally, if you tap a missed call tile, you can call back. Tap here to do a manual refresh of the list. You can filter the list by tapping the icon in the top left corner. If you want to post new updates on Twitter and Facebook, tap the status update icon. To select which services you want to post to, tap select services. You can post to Facebook and Twitter at the same time. In this example, we'll post only to Facebook. Tap the Facebook checkbox. Tap done. To write your new post, tap edit status and enter your message. When done, tap Send. Press the Back key. You can also link your Timescape contacts to your regular contacts. Tap the Link Contact icon. Tap OK. Scroll to a contact in your phone book and tap it. Tap OK to confirm that these contacts are the same person. You can now tap the contact icon to view the contact in the contact application. On the right hand side, you'll see the infinite button. Tap this to view the contact updates in Timescape. You are now presented with a filtered view of updates for this contact only. To change the filtering, tap the filter icon. You can now choose which updates you want to see. Choose between all events, a user filtered view, Twitter, Facebook, messages and missed calls. Tap all events. Timescape is also right on your desktop as a widget. Press the home key twice and locate the widget. If it isn't present, press the menu key and select arrange widgets. Tap the add widget button. Select Timescape and the widget is added to your desktop. Press the Home key to confirm. You can now watch the latest event at any time without opening Timescape. The widget also acts as a shortcut to Timescape. Tap it to start Timescape. Thank you for taking the time to view this film. You'll find more information about your phone by visiting the Xperia X10 Mini Support Zone, where you can improve your user experience.